<clears throat> well, after all the conversation that we had at our table and, and hearing people here, I feel like all of you could be up here giving my speech for me. So it's, uh, um, I'm really glad. Uh, yeah, now, I'm Bob Wilhelm, as I said, Vice Chancellor for Research and Economic Development. And it's, um, it's really been a pleasure to be with you here today. I know that this has been, or I hear that it's been an intense uh, uh, program for you. A few people seem a little tired. It sounds, sounds like that uh, all of your sponsors have really uh, kept you at it here for a couple of days. I, and I've heard many things that you've learned. So really glad that we could all be a part of this with you. Um, the range of the people in the programs that I've seen in the, in the, uh, in the program for this event is really is very impressive. And as a university, we're, we're just very proud uh, that we can host you here um, and to, for you to see uh, some of the kind of students and the students you can be, whether you're here at Lincoln campus or many other opportunities that you, you ought to consider uh, in terms of going on for a four-year program. Um, I, I really want to thank uh, Judy Goshkabash. I know she wasn't able to get here with us today. Uh, but uh, but uh, the executive director of the Nebraska Commission on Indian Affairs, she takes a very strong interest in this program. I know that you heard from her, what was it, last night? So, um, and of course, uh, Dr. Roulette, uh, we're really, we're just very, very proud of all of the commitment, the, the, the dedication that you put in and all of your team uh, put in uh, to make this uh, a very, a very compelling program. The, the, the both the, the Mid-America Transportation Center you know, has had a lot to do with making this MATC scholarship program possible and very successful and very sustained. So, great job. Do, do you ever have uh, people return for a second round? Sounds uh, like <laughs> we, we, if we have room, we encourage it. Yeah, it's okay. Yeah. So I said a little bit about the, what I do at the university. There's there, as you saw, all sorts of people thinking about all sorts of things uh, at a university like the University of Nebraska, spanning from people uh, that really take an interest in writing, whether they're in the journalism school or the English uh, department. Of course, lots of engineers. We've got plenty of them around the room to here today. Uh, but uh, of course, people that are working in medical studies, entrepreneurship, many, many uh, different ideas that people are coming up with. Of course, also the creative arts are very strong here. So all, there, there are many opportunities for you here. And I work with all of the faculty and students to help them really push ahead and come up with new ideas uh, and to make those ideas uh, into things that we can, we can either think about in terms of being a, a more human society or think about in terms of changing the world, in terms of our standard of living uh, or keeping the, the world uh, in a safe place. So it's a great job. Uh, and uh, along the way, I've had, I've had some great experiences, you know, re working on things to make things happen, whether it was in engineering uh, or in the writing that I've done. And I, I really hope that you'll, you'll have a, a great time forward as you start to think about uh, coming to a university uh, to finish a four year degree. Um, I, as I said, I've spent the a good amount of my time outside of the university, but uh, 25 years. This is actually my 26th year being a part of the university. Um, and there's the university, I'm really proud to think about that, that there's the mission of the university uh, is, to, is to build and to maintain a culture. And that culture comes from, again, from many different kinds of ideas, many areas of study, whether they're in engineering, teaching, arts, political science, cultural studies. Um, and I hope that you'll think about that as part of your opportunity, that to come to a university, uh, you have a chance to take a part of a lot of things. You also, I think, you, you know, you got, I, th I hope I heard from many that I talked to today that you found that even though this, this is a big place and there's a lot of variety, that there's also a way to find your place here and to find a group that you could be comfortable with, you know, and work as you sort of, as you take in different parts of the university. So, uh, you know, again, uh, I have high hopes for you. I, have, I really uh, want you to be leaders uh, in the universities that you that you join uh, as students, and perhaps I've heard several people talk about even doctoral degrees. That was the most fun I had in terms of my school. So I I, I wish you your very good uh, a good a very good experience in terms of moving on, moving ahead with even further uh, studies uh, at university. 
the, the scholars program is meant to provide you with information and experiences. It sounds like we packed it in pretty good here. Uh, to really to tell you, you know, a lot of the possibilities in terms of four-year program. Um, and we also want to, to make sure that you take away that we're interested to help you think about what's most important for you, what your path is, and how that might coincide. I, you know, hearing about just your experiences and what you're studying, you have many different paths, uh, and uh, we're glad that we can, we can be a part of that to help you think about what you're going to do in the future. Um, I want to close just by saying that we really want to thank again the students and the faculty uh, from UNL and the staff uh, and other institutions that have joined with us here for this program. Um, it's been a very special one. Um, as a university, many times we talk about results and impact and the like, but our greatest results and our greatest impact are the, the, the talented students that we, that we draw together into, into a community to learn and to grow, and I hope that you'll you'll be able to find the right place uh, in the next few years uh, to join in that as well. So thanks, and I'm really glad to be here with you today.